Yo, what's going on? Welcome to my channel. I'm your host, Tootie, and today we doing a review on a new microphone that I just got in the mail today. Fine AM8 streaming and recording microphone. We're gonna get into this and deep dive into what this microphone is exactly. As you guys can see, I'm currently using the Beacon microphone. Not a bad microphone whatsoever. I did enjoy it and I still do, but I do wanna find out if this microphone is able to compete and potentially even take the spot of my Beacon microphone. And in this video, we're gonna review this. We're gonna see what it sounds like. And we're also gonna be having some gameplay in there so we can see exactly how good it's gonna sound when I'm playing a game. If it's catching my voice and the volume good enough to the point where the game isn't washing me out. Now I'm gonna have it mounted to the boom arm. So, you know, it should be good, but we gotta see. Let's get into the review. So first and foremost, man, you guys already know, here's my ghetto version of me unboxing the, the microphone. Now, again, if you're new here, don't don't come at me, okay? Please don't. I, this is all I got. You, you guys got to take it or leave it. It's a good enough shot. You know what I'm saying? The lightning is okay. And, and yeah, you can still hear me. So anyways, let's open it. So the second you open the mic, they go ahead and give you the guide, the manual. You know what I'm saying? Everything that you're going to need to know about this here microphone. All the ins and the outs, how to hook it up and how to do right exactly okay so anyways let's keep on going here we have the bottom of the base mount you know what i'm saying but i'm not going to have mines put on the actual table but it does feel solid the quality doesn't feel cheap this feels uh not metal maybe titanium or something like that but it does feel solid and then it also has on the bottom of it the very bottom of the grip it has grip so that it won't just be sliding around on the table if you guys don't have a boom arm which is fine now moving on we're gonna take this out and immediately we get the microphone hold on let me uh let me smith mm. oh yeah oh yeah 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 five fine there you go that's that smell now i do want to say this the microphone itself, it definitely does not feel like high quality. Like it feels plastic and like I gotta be very careful because I might break it, which is scary. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, again, I'm not rough and like beating up and throwing my microphone around, but you still would like prefer it to feel better. Like the, the actual, I don't know, I wouldn't say mount, but the actual piece that holds the microphone so that you can put it on the boom arm or on the shock mount. It feels good. It feels heavy. It feels solid, like the good material, like it ain't going nowhere. But this, let's see, hold on. Maybe if I tighten it. Okay, there goes one side. That, that shouldn't happen. This is as tight as it can get and it's still moving around. So that, that kind of sucks, um, but that's an easy fix. And I'm sure that Fifine could actually change the material that they use to build this but that's the only harp the actual puff puff feels good it feels nice and this is what the microphone looks like without the puff puff on there you know what i'm saying now let's go over some of the things on the microphone already since we already at this point of view in this angle so as you guys can see here it is a USB-C. You can plug that in, plug and play essentially, and you guys will be good to go like that, which is how I'm gonna be using it. But as you can see, it also does come equipped with the X XLR for anybody out there that has one and wants to plug it in that way for a better sound and all the things that comes with the benefits of having an XLR. And then lastly, you guys can see there is a headphone jack down there so you can listen to yourself and the feedback, which is what we're gonna be doing today so we can actually hear what I sound like, not just when I start recording. Then moving on in the front of the microphone, your first knob right here, this is gonna control the microphone gain. Now I do advise everybody to stay away from messing with the gain on the microphone itself and actually use softwares or, or whatever you might have that helps control gain on your computer because that's gonna be a better outcome. In my opinion, I found that it's a little bit better to do it that way, but it is an option for you if you don't have access to those things. 
And then the next knob we got here at the bottom is the one that actually controls the headphone volume, which a lot of people and probably even myself are gonna use today because we gotta be able to listen to ourselves so that we know what the mic sounds like without actually having to wait until we get done editing the video and everything like that. And then we start to hear ourselves back. We don't want that. Then finishing up, as you guys can see right here, maybe not, but there is like that little dent right there and that's essentially just some place for us to be able to touch and we're going to be able to change the rgb lighting on here and everything like that if you're wanting the lights on i'm probably going to have it on because i want to see all the features of the microphone so there is that option i think they said there were four color selections that you can go through and then lastly if you guys can see there is the microphone mute button on the back of it it's not an actual button it's kind of like engraved into the microphone but if you just touch that it's supposed to be able to mute the microphone so we're gonna also mess around with that and see how well that works all right now as you guys can see man we got the microphone hooked up and we got it all ready to go and we even obviously getting the voice recording part of this done and i'm gonna be real with y'all man i tested the mic out a little bit had the headphones in i listened to myself i did it about five times and i even added some eq from the elgato app because i do currently have the stream deck plus so i was able to mess around with a little bit of that as you guys can hear i can control the gain of my microphone and practically sound like i don't exist almost to the point where i don't and then i can turn it all the way up and get my game right back which is why i said i probably won't use the dial on here now you can and i did actually tweak it a little bit i turned it slightly from the middle to the right side where you get more gain but i'm not gonna mess with it too much more from there i can also y'all just so you know mute as you can see right there i can mute the microphone whenever i see fit so i can have a full-blown conversation talking and now you guys hear me having a full-blown conversation with you again but that's not the only place obviously like i said the underneath button as you guys can see on my thumb right there it is green indicating that my microphone is working but the you know what i'm saying like as you guys can see you couldn't even hear me so that's also a good option to make sure you know you can mute from there just in case you don't have what i have which is just allows me to mute right there i probably won't use it too much and honestly i don't know how i'm gonna have the microphone set up just yet if i want the mute button on the top or if i want it on the bottom because i do like to move my mic around a whole bunch but you know what i'm saying maybe i'll just move it from the sides or something like that now as far as like just talking about everything else review wise on the microphone i say that this is a pretty damn good microphone like i like the way my voice sounds i like the fact that if you talk into the mic which some people are going to they're going to talk directly into the mic it's going to pick them up pretty well as long as you don't have it too far away from your mouth you're not going to sound super distant and then you're not going to have to turn up the game to where you're blowing someone's eardrums out or just making your own voice sound distorted because too much gain is not good it makes you sound unnatural and then it you kind of gonna start picking up some of that fuzz and the static noise that you don't want that you you really don't so keep the microphone a little bit closer as far as the xlr part goes like i said man i can't do that maybe when i do get the piece we'll go over and we'll do a second part to this video but i'll let you guys know so to make sure that you're up to date on that on whether or not i get that piece and we do another review video you should definitely subscribe to the channel and like the video so you can stay updated and i can keep you posted whenever i am getting ready to drop another review video on some type of tech or if we just playing video games. Now it's time for the fun part. One of my favorite parts of this segment that I like to do is I actually like to review and finish the video off where I play video games and just kind of see how well they perform with whatever video game that I am playing at the moment. Stay tuned for that. And then we're gonna give the final review overall rating score of this microphone. They are getting active over there, Jordan. In the city? Uh, no, nah, look, look. To, oh, gold shoddy. Come on, let, let's let's get over there and see what they talking about, Jordan. It's over here, northwest. All right. To the right of me. Yep, in the water. In the water. Mm -hmm. I see him. The one in. Oh, he's so hurt. Pushing up on his ass. Wait, wait, wait. Okay.
I ain't about to have no more AR, boy. Yeah, you gonna fight me, bitch. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not. Stay in the truck for a second, Jordan. We gonna go to... Uh... Oh, yep, yep. Keep driving. Keep driving. Hit a left. And we're gonna hit this building right here. The AI are here, so I'm contemplating. But the only issue is the other... Resin! Killed he him. really tried to stick He's it. Hey, he tried, boy. His homeboy had to be in his ear. Stick it, bro! Don't you f***ing stop! Hmm. Jordan, Jordan, they fighting the AI. I don't got ammo for this. Make ammo for it. Okay. Let me get my 3D printer out. Knocked one. Push. Right here. Bakugo. That's right, that's right. He went upstairs. No way. Get his ass, Jordan. Nice boy. Oh, I don't see. Yeah. I'm right here on the bike. Yep, 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 yep. Mm, get wrecked, kid. Eat don't frick. Don't dare let him get away, Fortnite. Yeah, that bike is hurting. I said, damn, I need new wheels. I knocked him. This is why I love this gun so much, G. Where you at? Hmm? Hey, Jordan, let's let's uh, let's uh reposition over here to the left. They are here. They are right here. Oh, shit. 125. Bye, bitch. Oh. And he had my dick. This nigga had the plasma Optimus Prime grenade and my gun. There is no need for all that, sir. Uh oh. Oh. Uh -oh. Okay. Hey, our, our bounty is behind us, G. Okay. Okay. We stay close and. Oh, right there. Right there. Right there. Look at him. Look at him. Uh huh. Uh huh. These niggas have. Nice. Two AIs. Behind that rock right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got the rock. 25, 24. Ain't no resin, B. Oh, it was our bounty, too. He's running. He's down at the bottom, Jordan, right below us. Come on, Jordan. Yes. Ah, ah. Nice. I ripped him. 97 flesh. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Come on. Don't worry about the team behind us, bro. Come on. Hey, play your game. Don't let nobody take you out. It'll look at you. Top five. And you the solo. I kind of want to go down there today. No, 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 no. All you want right to okay? So you want to take the chance of going down? I mean, hey, it's your call. Play your game. So there was the one team on the car. Mm-hmm. Res. So now it's six people. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, up there with you. Yup, 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 yup. Make a move. He's pulling up. Might as well. Come on, Jordan. There it is. Get back. Oh, my. oh, you're good. You're solid. Eat that fish. Nope. You're dead. You should always yeah. eat the fish first. Oh, well, I guess it's not going. Yeah, it does. <gasps> Take that chance. How? Josh. How, dog? How much shield does he have? I'm so, y'all, I think we wrap this video up with what I got. But I still say for about $60, you cannot go wrong with this microphone on Amazon. Link will be down in the description below, as it always will be for any type of products that I review and stuff like that. So you guys can pick this up on Amazon if you are interested in it. 
it is a really good mic in my opinion my only downside to it is i wish that the actual build for the microphone didn't feel so plastic and, and like fake oh and i guess the last little bonus one but it's not a huge issue is the fact that i should not be able to do this with the microphone once i've tightened the screws but overall for my second five fine uh product you know what i mean like i would say they are so far two for two and just knocking the ball out the park man with affordable products that work really well like this is a really good budget microphone and if we had to rate it overall i say looks i like the way it looks it's a pretty good looking mic build again i'm 50 50 on it and then the sound quality of it pretty damn good so overall i'm gonna say this is about an 8.5 out of 10 in microphones for me and even comparing it to my beacon microphone for it to slightly sound a little off from that microphone that's a 200 dollars microphone by the way a 200 dollars microphone barely above a 60 dollars microphone that's a win in my book that's my take on it guys i i think you should definitely invest into the microphone and if you're interested in any other products for maybe like gaming purposes or streaming or even youtube content check out the five fine headphone video i have it right here for you guys to check out again another great product but you guys got to see what i say in that review and if you're interested in a great gaming pair of headphones but i'll catch you guys in the next video